Let's take a look at the chart action for Bitcoin. Okay, so here's what we've been looking at. We have resistance right here, resistance right here. We have this downtrend going like this. Until we break this downtrend going to the upside, until we break this downtrend going to the upside, then I'm assuming it's pushing us down or we're going to get resistance on it. Right now, it looks like we're creating this little like space right now. I'm kind of wondering if we're going to get a bounce and maybe get some volatility. But until then, it looks like we're just kind of pushing down. The next levels that I'm looking at is around 30,000, this previous support right here. It actually came down to around 29.5. So maybe that's another level to look at. But I'm looking at maybe a horizontal line, something like this. Until we break this downtrend, going to the upside, I'm looking at around 30,000. It looks like we're getting closer and closer. We have some pretty good red volume coming in last day or two. I mean, today we're getting a nice red one. Yesterday we had a nice red one. Looks like it's a little bit lower, but we're still pushing to the downside. So, yeah, hopefully we can hold support right here. We also have support, support to at least spots that we had support at. Maybe we can get a bounce and bounce out of this trend line, but I'm not sure until we do break it. I'm not really sure what's going to happen. The main thing I'm watching is this spot right here, and I'm hoping that we can hold support over here. Maybe we could get a bounce sometime. I've been kind of thinking that maybe we're going to get a bounce and, I don't know, break this little downtrend that we have and maybe kind of get a bounce, something like that, and then continue to head down. Not too sure. If we jump over the one hour time frame, this is another thing that I've been looking at, though. We have like these little supports that we're getting. That's why I was saying I'm kind of wondering if we're going to get a bounce sometime because we're kind of getting support, support. We had this support line like this, and then we broke it going to the downside. I've been watching these as well. If we if we get support, if we get these little trend lines, then we start breaking them. Then I'm thinking we're going to head down even more. But the other thing I'm looking at is kind of something like this. I don't know. In general, we're, we're trending down. And if we go jump into like the one hour time frame, we can kind of get an idea if we're going to continue to head down. I was kind of watching this little triangle pattern, something like this. We broke it to the downside. I was kind of looking at a target, something like this. But let's see what happens. In general, I'm looking at 30,000 and I'm looking at the daily time frame, kind of watching these downtrends, waiting for a bounce, maybe a break to the upside. Maybe we can get a bounce up, but I'm not really sure until we start breaking some of these trend lines. Let me know what your prizes, price targets, or analysis is in the comments. If you have any questions, check out my Discord. I'll leave a link in the comments as well. If you're new to trading, check out this video. It's a video on when I buy and sell crypto. If you guys liked the video, hit that thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one.